hobby, and that's making some beauty products and household cleaners and stuff like that natural. I am a natural girl, and I don't like chemicals. I don't like them on my face, on my body, or inside of my body. I think we are just in, inundated, in, in, how do you say that? Inundated with bad chemicals that we don't need. We can't even pronounce or read some of them. So let's see if we can try to make something on our own. And I was using this natural product. It's Boom Silk and it had olive oil, beeswax, some honey in it, and it had some vitamin E and some extra virgin olive oil. And I thought, hey, these are things that I could probably get and try to you know, make up my own. <laughs> and it was $29 for just two ounces. And I don't know about you, but I don't like spending money on my face. And, and this is not just for face, it's for your body too. And, and it's wonderful on the hands. I love it on my hands. So I'm gonna go and tell you what's, what it's all about here. I looked it up, I tried to Google the same exact ingredients and the closest I could come was something on OurSimpleHomestead.com. Her name is Tracy and she has tons and tons of exciting recipes on there. Make your own stuff. I think I'll try the lip balm next time. So what I learned in, in Toastmatic Masters not to say so, so I'm gonna try not to, oops. <laughs> okay, beeswax is your first ingredient. And these are pellets, so you don't have to grate, grate it. You want to get the pellets and you can get them on Amazon. So that's your first ingredient. And it's just a half a cup for, for six bottles of, of uh, two ounce bottles. Um, a cup of extra virgin olive oil, organic. And uh, what is it? Uh, half a cup of this coconut oil. So these first three ingredients, you... Um, put in a double boiler um, on the top part of the double boiler and then the simmering water down below and you stir it around until it melts and then you let it cool for 15 minutes. So, and then I like this, it has a little pour spout. Um, then the, the next two ingredients are the um, essential oil. You can use any kind you want. I like grapefruit and the orange and lemon that kind of citrusy, and the vitamin E oil. So those you add after you let it cool for 15 minutes, because I guess because these can't really, they don't, they don't like the heat. So you have one, two, three, four, five ingredients. And I don't know how much this costs. My husband said he'll help me figure it out how much of my bottle cost. I think it costs about $2 is what I'm guessing. We'll see if I'm right or not when he, wakes up from his nap and tells me. Um, he, he's the mathematical genius in the family, so he'll figure it out. Um, I don't use a whole lot of stuff. I'm aging now. Well, we're all aging. <laughs> Even in the womb, we're aging. <laughs> so, but as a um, oh, third act woman from 60 to 90, I'm 72. Uh, I think less is more when it comes to makeup. Yeah, I, I use this L'Oreal um, brow styler. It's, it's, it doesn't cost a lot and it doesn't break because it, 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 it rolls up. So I'm gonna put that, you know, all these ingredients, I'm gonna, all these uh, things that I use, I'm gonna have links for. And this Thrive, uh, it's Thrive Mascara, I love it. it. Makes my, you know, can actually see my lashes and I don't want those little whisk broom type false eyelashes either. You know, I just, you know, I don't like false looking stuff. And I do my own brows and I do very lightly on the brows. I don't do like really dramatic fake things. Um, as far as lipstick, I, I do like different kinds of lipstick, but this is the Boom brand. And uh, I like it cause it's a nice thick uh, tube of, of looks, lipstick and I can I need a mirror to put it on, and I, I can use it as a uh, little bit of color on my cheeks, a little bit of color up here, color, you know, just give my face a little color since I'm so um, 
fair skin. You can call it pale, or you can call it fair, fair skin. But this is kind of, when I rub it on a lot, it starts turning red, but that redness will go away. So that is what I use. And the, the recipe comes from Tracy, her name's Tracy, and she has a website that has tons of wonderful recipes. It's called OurSimpleHomestead.com. And this particular recipe only took 30 minutes to make. And I think it's well worth the time and effort. If I can say, if I can declutter some of my beauty products, it's a, it's a multi-billion dollar uh, industry. <laughs> it's trying to convince us that we need to buy all this stuff for our skin. I, I'm not convinced. I'm just not convinced. So, I, 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 as people ask me, well, don't you have sunscreen? Yes, I do, because I had some pre-cancer cells on my nose a couple of years ago. I have to be really careful, and I have to wear uh, like this hat that I bought the other day with a very wide brim to, to protect my nose. This is a good winter hat, and I have one for summer, too. So, I'll spray this on. It's Trader Joe's brand sunscreen. And it's, it's, it's very clear, it's a clear liquid. I need to put that on my skin before I put on the moisturizer. And sometimes if I'm really going out to something fancy, I'll use a concealer on, on these little veins here. Got some veins here, I'll use a little bit of concealer. Sometimes I'll use a little natural color uh, eyeshadow, but I don't ever overdo it anymore. I don't like the overdue look. Uh, over, overdone look. I don't even like to do my nails. These nails are fine. They're fine and they're healthy and they're not going to be germ traps. You know, <laughs> this is, this, no, I think as we age, less is more. Less is better when it comes to cosmetics and comes to the, oh, to how we, we uh, present ourselves to the world. We don't have to be looking like models. Uh, I'm retired now, and this is how I look 98% of the time, unless I'm really dolling up to go somewhere. And if some of this moisturizer, which I use all over, if it, some of it gets up on my hair, it kind of makes my hair a little shiny. So it's a win-win. So I hope that you, you uh, for those on social media that really wanted this, you will find it. <laughs> Um, I do a YouTube video. This is the YouTube video, and then I, I have the YouTube video on my website plus more detail and the actual recipe, which I will post on my website. And I post every second and fourth Tuesday of the month. Talk to you later.